Yes boys, welcome back to this brand new FIFA 20 video. This is going to be the first video of the year on actual FIFA 20. Yesterday I did go ahead, open my starter packs, stuff like that. I didn't get anyone good. I've seen a few people made videos on the starter packs. I was going to make a video on it, but I didn't really see the point, simply because who really cares about opening a few starter packs, a few all-player packs, a few 5k packs. No one really cares, I don't think. I've got these players from it, but today, obviously, as you can see by the title, I'm going to be going ahead and showing you the League and Nation Hybrid cheapest poss possible solution. I currently don't have enough coins to complete it. I'm not sure if you do. Definitely leave a comment down below. And also remember to drop a like on the video if you are new. And yeah, just drop a like. It really doesn't mean a lot. Um, also, make sure you do subscribe to the channel if you are new and also turn the notifications on. So you don't miss a single video. Um, if you do want to see a Road to Glory this year, make sure you do go ahead, drop a comment down below. I may do that. I'm not too sure, though. I'm a bit stuck on time, so I don't know if I can upload a Road to Glory the way other people upload them. So I may just do reward videos and obviously, like, play reviews, stuff like that. Just let me know in the comment section down below what you do want to go ahead and see. Obviously, keep in mind, when you are completing this SBC here, right now could potentially be not the greatest time to go ahead and complete it, simply because the full game isn't out, so all these players are a little bit more expensive than they will be when the full game comes out. But keep in mind, when the full game does come out, um, these players will start to drop in price, and it'll be a lot easier to go ahead and complete the SBC itself. Um... One of them does require loyalty, so you can't actually complete it straight away. It is this Puzzle Master one, so I just thought I'd let you know at the beginning of the video. But I'll show you the cheapest solution for all of them now. I'm going to be going through each team and just showing you how you can complete it for the cheapest possible way. Um, but in net for the first squad, we have got uh, Gunnock. I'm not sure who he does play for, but I have been. I did uh, do a few different ways you can complete this earlier on. But he's called Gunnock, of course. I don't have him, so I'm going to have to do it in concept. How do I do that? It's here concept go not here he is so we've got him there how do we get this off the screen i'm not too sure oh there we go uh, so we've got gunnock in net um and then at left center back link into gunnock we do have tech demir he's called i hope it doesn't change the concept thing it does every single time um tech demir that's who we do have there at left center back we have to put concept in every time because for some reason ea is stupid again and they don't keep it where it just locks on what you last had it on it's a little bit stupid, but there's not much that we can do. Um, and then at left back, we do have Calderim, who, again, he's going to get the strong link. He plays for, he comes from the same country, of course, as the centre back. So it's fairly simple. Um, but yeah, and then at left mid, we do have Arda Taran, who, of course, uh, he's had a lot of problems at the minute, hasn't he? About shooting a gun or something in an airport. He's going to going to prison, something like that, which is just crazy. He's still on FIFA, though, and he works for this squad, so we are going to be throwing him in. And then at middle centre mid, we have got Carvecki, who plays uh, for the same squad, of course. Again, another strong link. Keep in mind, these players probably will rise if this video... Uh, does get quite a few views and obviously a lot of people will be picking up the same players so just keep that in mind when you are picking them up and uh, just keep in mind this is just a little bit of a template like you can literally change the whole left side of the squad to anything that you want and it will work this is just the left side of the squad that I'm going to use I just thought I'd let you know with that but there we go on that side we've got that side completed and then on the right side we are going to go with Netherlands keep in mind the right back as well probably will be quite expensive because he plays just because right backs always are expensive when they're from a certain nation with the same league. Um, but we do have at right back Kars Dorp. He does play for um, Feyenoord, I think it is. Uh, and then he is <clears throat> from Netherlands. And then we've got a uh, centre back next to him. Vier Giva, I'm not sure how you pronounce it, but this guy 76 rated. Again, not too expensive for this guy. It should cost about 5k for this squad overall. And then at right mid, we do have Stengs, who again, very, very good. Very, very good card. We've got Stengs at right mid, 75 rated. Not a good card, but you know what I mean. Uh, you could use these guys for starter squads, to be fair. But it is always worth completing these SBCs. Maybe you should wait until you get the full game. Obviously, EA Access is meant to come out today at around 4pm. I will be making videos on that when it does come out. But um, keep in mind, obviously, it is probably better that you do... Um, wait to save a few coins up and wait till the full game comes out just because 
certain players will be more expensive right now. And then, of course, up front, we've got Castro's favourite player, Hunter Law. And then that is the first squad complete. Seven out of seven requirements, 100 chemistry, exactly gold, everything completed. And I'm pretty sure you do get a decent pack for the first one. I'm not sure what it is. It doesn't tell you, does it? Um, it's here on the right, actually. If I just scroll down here, you do get a rare mixed players pack for that. But yeah, that's the first squad of it all. It is called the Challenger. Into the advanced squad anyway. The next one, um, we'll go through this. In net, we do have Butland, who again, won't be too expensive. He does play for Stoke still, I'm pretty sure, uh, who are in the championship. So it should be quite easy to complete this one. we we'll throw him in net there. And then um, at right centre back, we do have Tarkowski from Burnley. <clears throat> getting the weak link in obviously because he plays for England Tarkowski at right centre back um, and then at left centre back we do have Keane from Everton pretty sure it's Michael Keane he shouldn't be too expensive but again it's early on in FIFA so he could easily be quite expensive 80 rated centre back plays for Everton uh, middle centre mid we do have a drink water from um, Burnley as well it's really annoying that I've got to change that to concept every single time. It would be so much quicker if I could just type the name in and slot them in. Maybe I did um, do this slightly wrong. I should have probably had all the players ready in the squads at the beginning of the video, but I'll do that next time. I really do apologise for that, but just make sure you skip through if I am taking too long. I really do apologise. Um, right mid, we do have... That is Zappa Costa at right back. Sorry, I didn't say it. Right mid, we do have Politano. I'm pretty sure you pronounce it. 82 rated card. Could be a little bit more expensive, but again, quite players are players are quite cheap uh, because obviously people are opening the packs at the beginning. They're just launching them on the market. They don't really care. Um, but again, like I said, probably better off waiting until the full game comes out. Uh, maybe not even the full game, just when um, you get the game on EA Access because that's when a lot more players will be on the market. Due to YouTubers, all these people opening packs, it will just work out a lot better for you. Uh, but here we do have up front... Jonathan, it's pronounced Jonathan. 75 rated Soriano. Um, change that to concept. Put him up front. Um, it's the uh, how come we've got two clubs already on this game? I don't understand that. Um, and then at uh, centre mid here we have Juan Jordan. Again, shouldn't be too expensive. Spanish centre mid. Um, this one should cost you around six to seven k, I think, something like that. But again, if you don't have the coins, like I said. Wait till the full release comes out. Keep in mind, I'm not, I'm not completing this SBC simply because I don't have the coins. If I had the coins and I had the full game, I'll be completing it. But I just can't as of right now, obviously, because the access ain't out or anything like that. Um, but at left mid, we do have Borja Garcia. And then finally, at left back, we've got Esquadero. Um, Esquadero. 79 rated left back from Spain. And then that's the second squad completed. Um, as you can see, 7 out of 7 requirements, 79 rated, 100 chemistry. Um, players from same nation, max 5, same league, max 5. Again, fairly simple to complete that one. And you will be getting, in return from it, a gold players premium. So that's a 25 players pack, uh, 25k pack, sorry. it's It should be a premium gold players pack, I think that's what it should be. Um... But it's pronounced differently on there. But then, anyway, onto the third squad being Fiendish. Um, that's how you pronounce it, I'm pretty sure. In net, we have got uh, Paul Lopez, 83 rated keeper, non rare. Keep in mind, this guy could be a little bit expensive simply because he's 83 rated and he's non rare. So he's a little bit more rare on the market. And obviously, it's early on in FIFA, so he will be a little bit expensive. Uh, centre back, we do have Fazio, the 80 rated card. Also from Roma. Um, and then at right back, we've got Zappa Costa again. He was in the last squad, but he will be in this squad as well. Um, he's just an easy one to throw in. Obviously, Italian. He plays for Roma. Um, but yeah. Then at, at right cam, we do have Sigurdsson, 83 rated card. Obviously, you've got to get a little bit more high rating on, this, on these squads. So we're going to have to start throwing in a little bit more high rated players. But again, he's 83 rated. He isn't really a desirable player. He's a player that people pack and throw straight on the market simply because of his pace. And he isn't the greatest. Same with the striker in this squad being Giroud. Um, then we've got Andre Gomez at CDM, also playing for Everton. Um... Andre Gomez. 
um, concept. There we go, throw him in there. Get that link into Sigurdsson. And then, of course, up front, we do have Laborde. That's how you pronounce him, pretty sure. Laborde. Laborde. 78 rated card. French striker. Just gets a link into Giroud. You can literally put any French striker there. But I've just cho chose to throw him in. And then at right, at left CDM, we do have Danilo Pereira, who's an 83 rated card. Could be a little bit expensive on the market, but he will drop in price when the full game comes out. Keep in mind with that one as well. And then we do have Jao Mario, uh, uh, left attacking mid. He has got a transfer to the Russian league. Uh, change that to concept, throw him in there, Portuguese. And then he links to Danilo Pereira. And then at left back, we do have Esquadero again. Same as the last squad. Just an easy one to throw in there. Uh, Esquadero, 79 rated. And then to get him the strong link, the actual perfect link, we are going to throw in Sergi Gomez here. Sergi Gomez. So the first three squads for this don't require any loyalty. Remember that when you are completing it. 7 out of 7 again. 81 rated squad done. Exactly 6 nations. 6 leagues. 3 players from the same nation. 3 players from the same league. 81 rated and 90 chemistry. This does have bang on 90 chemistry. You'll be getting a 35k pack in return for this. So this is where the rewards do start to become a lot better. Um, and then obviously for completing the whole thing. You do get a rare gold kit. And 13k. So again, quite decent, but onto the final squad here, you probably won't be able to complete this because no one does have the full game, but when obviously, if you're watching this video, when you do have the full game, this one will require loyalty no matter which way you look at it. Um, but in net, for the Ajax Keeper, we will be throwing in Onana, who has got an upgrade this year, 82 rated. Um, and then at middle centre back, we are going to throw in Vida. Uh, that plays for Croatia, of course. I remember him against England. And then we've got 84 rated Pepe at right centre back. He, there's no way around it. You kind of do have to have an 84 rated player in this team. There's more, not much you can do. Um, I would try and reduce the cost, but obviously it's not really going to work. You're just going to have to throw someone in there that does bring in the rating. Obviously, it's early on in FIFA. People won't be able to afford these players. But obviously, when it does come out, you can always come back to this video or maybe search in this video two weeks down the line. I just thought I'd make it because it will help a lot of people. Then we've got Gelson Martins at right mid. Uh, getting the Portuguese link into Pepe. And then at centre mid here, we are going to be throwing in a cam. Keep in mind, you are going to have to do a few position changes for this squad as well. <clears throat> like, for example, we do have Goetzer up front as a striker that you're going to have to convert to a striker, I'm pretty sure, from a centre attack in mid. Um, and then at centre mid here, we do have Delaney from um, Dortmund. Quite a good card this year. Um, throw him in there. He did. He does have an inform as well. So again, you might have to change this one around because he won't actually be in packs his normal card. But <clears throat> I'll think of another way for that. Or obviously just swap them around. You just need two eighty-two rated players from any clubs, a centre mid and a striker, and you'll be able to complete that one. Very very simple. It does require loyalty, obviously, as I did say. So you might not be able to complete this one for a while anyway. But we've got Lamar, Thomas Lamar, at left mid. Um, throwing him in there for Atletico and then we've got Vitolo at left wing to get the link into him only 79 rated this year um, Vitolo 79 rated throw him in there at left wing and then you are going to have to change him from a left mid to left wing in game but up front we do have Goetze but like I said you probably won't be able to do this this way so obviously just throw someone else in there Mario Goetze throw two different players in there that play for the same squad, uh, same club they don't have to be a perfect link um just make sure they're both 82 rated or one's 83 rated and the other one is um, one's 83 rated, the other one's 81 and it should still work. Either way, it doesn't matter too much. Oh, I hate when I do that. Uh, concept player, Keita Balde, a right wing. And then finally, the left centre back will be Zuma for Chelsea. He could be a little bit expensive because he's quite overpowered and people want him in the starter squads. But again, he will drop in price as the year goes on. But that's how you do complete this one. It's only got 70 chemistry, as you can see. You do need 85. But when you convert Goethe to striker, convert him to centre mid, Delaney. Uh, convert Vitolo to left wing. Convert Balde Dial to right wing. And then all you have to do from there is obviously get the loyalty. If you don't know how to do loyalty, uh, the loyalty glitch, then I will probably make a video on that when the full game does come out. Just to show you how you can do the loyalty glitch. But like I said, make sure you do go ahead. Drop a like on the video if you have enjoyed it. And it has helped you out. That would be much appreciated. 
make sure you do subscribe to the channel you do get a rare mega pack for this one which is a very good pack but yeah make sure you do subscribe to the channel and turn notifications on that'll be much appreciated i am going to be coming with more videos as the year does go on so make sure you do uh, show some support follow me on instagram at mccartneyyt and also follow me on Twitch, McCartneyYT, and also Twitter, McCartney underscore Ben. Just DM me or drop a comment down below with any videos you want to see. That will be much appreciated. I really hope you enjoyed, and peace out.